what is up you guys hi welcome back i'm grabbing a purse right now come on okay hi <laughs> i just go hi 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 starting off a vlog a few days of my life um apartment is a mess i have laundry going i have i'm like cleaning my couch right now in the process but i kind of ruined the my like couch cushions because there's a grate in my dryer that has like something on it and it got black stuff all over my couch cushions and i genuinely don't know what to do and i haven't texted my mom about it yet so i'm like waiting till i text my mom and ask her what to do but until then i'm just not gonna um really fix it and just i haven't sat on my couch like it's it's what living alone does to you so cool but i have a hair appointment right now we're getting these roots done i think i'm gonna tell um my hair is so bad right now i had a workout and i like didn't wash it after and then i tanned and there's like tanning oil in it it's disgusting but i'm telling my hairdresser i just want it to be like so blonde like maybe the color of those flowers over there but yeah let's go So happy got my hair done and it looks so good I needed to get my roots touched up I feel like quarantine just so messed up my roots oh I didn't get a ticket cool my like parking ran out while I was in there but quarantine obviously messed up my root and my color because it grew out so much that I just need to, like I needed to get it done um, sooner than normal because i literally just got it done in june but yeah anyway yeah i'm so happy i feel like a new person whenever i get my hair done i wish i could put this down and you could see me but i always get questions about my hair and i know since like i'm talking about me getting my hair done since i feel since i'm talking about getting my hair done like me getting it done in this video um, I always get questions about where I get it done and who does it and stuff. Um, but I get it done at John Arago Studios on Newberry Street, right above Cafe Nero. Um, and Jonna does my hair. So I think there's two people there, but I get my hair done by Jonna. She's the best. And I go in and I either get a full foil, which I got today, I got a full foil, um, or I get like a partial foil. And I also got like a little, not a trim, but I just got like a clean up. I had her clean up my layers, make them fresh. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. Um, what else do I have to say? She's the best, she always gets DMs too. People asking like what I get done specifically to my hair. And she's like, it's so hard to like explain cause she does it. Like I just let her do her thing. And I trust her with like everything for my hair. I literally could be like, give me a cut short but make it look good. And even if she cut it up to here, it would still look so good. So yeah, that's what I got done. And now we are gonna go home and make dinner tonight. Me, Maggie and Graydon are making dinner. We're gonna have a little night of um, homemade food, but I need to go because it's a green light right now and I don't want to miss it. So let's go. This is also a good parking spot, so whoever wants it. Up, you guys. I feel like this is literally a me, a me in the car, a uh, car vlog. It is currently, um, what day is it today? Thursday? Yeah, it's Thursday today. And I had a workout this morning. I will insert footage from my workout right now. You don't know it, but I noticed you right away. You're pretty sure I will ignore every move you make. Come over, come over. I work out with my trainer. I'll have his instagram down below because i always get questions on which workouts i do and stuff but 
I obviously like work out with my trainer and we do specific things, which is really cool. He has this app and we actually have our own little program on the app and it's the biggest thing about the program on his app is about consistency and it really helps you stay consistent with working out. And it's gonna be so easy for the ones that are going back to school since obviously no gyms are open at colleges. Um, you're gonna have to do dorm workouts and you're able to do these workouts in the dorm. If you're at home, you can do them at home. Like they don't require equipment. You can use equipment if you have like weights or stuff but you don't need them so it's perfect for at home just like really good for the times right now and you guys would love the workouts they are we've done them before and they're just oh they're so effective it's great to get into a routine so because consistency is key my biggest tip on getting back into a routine of working out and living a healthy lifestyle is consistency and that's like one of the biggest things that we have with this little program i'm going to do a post about it on my instagram though so if you guys don't follow me can i not with my hair if you guys don't follow me on instagram and you want to learn more about the workouts go follow me on there i post on my story our workouts here and there um but mostly going to be posting a lot more about the app on my instagram story i just walked so close to my car so yeah Head over to my Instagram. I will have it right here. It's Emma McDonald. And we'll talk about it there. Um, but what did I want to say today? Oh, I had my workout this morning. I am on my way to go get some apartment stuff. And there was something specific that I wanted to say, but I don't know what it is. I'll think about it. I'm like losing my mind today. Oh, my goodness gracious. I'm a little sleepy, so I could go to bed. But no, I have a busy day. And this light is taking so long. Bag secured. I'm sweating right now, guys. That was so hot. I lugged those bags literally like seven blocks down Newberry. And I'm lit I'm out of breath and I'm sweating. But I met the cutest subscriber working at Crate and Barrel. Her and her sister, or she said that her sister watches my videos um and they're from the middle east and it was so cool talking to her about it and if she is watching this or if her sister is watching this hi guys um i'm so glad i got to meet you because that was like i don't know it's just so nice to talk to you and i love when you guys say hi to me because it puts a face to the number because obviously I, when i'm just like looking at my youtube it just shows a number and you're just like oh but then when you meet the people you're like i don't know it's just so cool you f i feel like i have a connection with all of you like you guys are all of my friends so i don't know i just love saying hi to you guys and meeting you guys and it was so great to meet you so yeah um i have to drive home now my mom is at maggie's apartment helping her with stuff and they're gonna help me hang some mirrors Got some apartment stuff I'll show you guys when I get back to my apartment and I have to film a video today. You guys are gonna be so excited. I've been getting so many comments being like, where is this video? You've been talking about it for a week, but I've been waiting for all of my clothes to come in to film it, but it is a um, clothing haul, not sponsored. I need to bring the rest in. <laughs> Not bring the rest in but bring the rest up because i ordered some new stuff online that i want to show in the hall and i've been waiting for it so i need to bring it up to my apartment when i get back yeah a lot of packages came in i opened them all up early i have to go throw this stuff away but something i wanted to show you guys my new caseify phone case came in it is so cute so i got this to give to maggie and i put the photo of her and i on it from my birthday and she walks into my apartment and I didn't even I like put it I on forgot Instagram, so I'm like oh this is I know so she cute. picks it up I like didn't know that it was on my counter because I was gonna like give it to her and she picks it up she goes oh my god this is so cute I was like yeah I literally got that for you um Thank you, Em. you're welcome this is such a I like pick. want it I'm so jealous that I gave it to you but so it's so cute I love that a lot. Oh my god, case of I, case of I. So yeah, you guys can check out um, this case. I will have 
a link down below and you guys know like I love my case of iPhone cases you can personalize them the impact case is my favorite it's the one that is drop proof so when you drop your phone Maggie drop your phone right now your phone is safe because it's an impact case. <laughs> no, but the impact case, no, I fine. swear by it. Um, I'm the clumsiest person ever with my phone and it doesn't ever make your phone break. I also put another big order in of case by cases for that like are gonna come in soon. So basically just go to my hair. Ah, go to caseify.com slash Emma and you guys will get 20% off your new favorite phone case and we can match Well, we can either match or you can like customize your own case to your liking Obviously put your own photos on here You can put your name on here um, You can just do a solid color. I love the solid colors as well as putting my like initials on it. I feel like initials is so personalized and so cute. I always switch out between having an initial one or just a plain colored one. But what I love most about Caseify's solid color cases is that they're not like the solid color. They're kind of like, not like, not clear, but um, they're like see-through, you know? So it's like the color, but it like looks like this. Like that looks like the color. I don't know, I just really like that. You guys know my red one that I always have on my phone. So, yeah, check them out. I'll have everything down below on the screen and use my code. I got this new thing for my hair and it like crimps your hair. So I love when I take my hair out of a braid, but I hate braiding my hair because it breaks it so much. And I mean like curling it isn't as, isn't even better. But anyway, I got this little guy off of Amazon and so far i mean like i need to learn to use it a little bit better but it looks so good like it's just quick and easy little beach waves and it just does something different to your hair because i always have my hair natural just straight and it's pin straight like 24 7 it's so annoying um but this like adds something to it and it looks so good i love it i need to run to my sister's apartment my dad just got here we're gonna do dinner and he wants to watch the bruins game tonight but I need to like pack and stuff. So I don't know if I can do that. But yeah. I just set up the TV for my dad and I've never put live TV on here before, but he wanted to watch hockey. So we figured it out. Woo. Okay. And I'm cleaning my couch too. And it, I like kind of ruined those right there that are on the ground. So I have to fix them. So that's why the other half is not made. Washing all of the stuff that I got today. And I'll show you guys it once it's all done. It's a lot of stuff for my apartment, like kitchen stuff. This water filter thingy that Maggie has. Yeah, I got the same one as you. Sorry if you guys can't hear me because the TV. It's really, I don't want to pack right now. I literally, I think like, I don't know why, packing is probably one of the easiest things to do. I am just so not good at it. So I need to pack right now and I guess it'll hold me accountable that I'm gonna pack and show you guys what I'm packing. So make me pack quicker. Um, but I wanna try to at least go to bed early tonight. Hopefully I'm praying that I can go to bed early. So um, I'm gonna pack and show you guys what I'm packing, but I'm packing for Nantucket. Okay, I literally have dresses thrown out on the ground. I'm gonna finish packing in the morning. It is currently 12 right now, but I'm gonna pack the rest in the morning and show you guys what I bring. Literally just dresses. I haven't even picked out jeans or anything, but I just don't know what to bring. Um, and I can't think about it right now. I like want to go to bed so bad. So I'll see you guys in the morning to finish Oh, leave it to me as you guys saw last night. I didn't finish packing at all Um, but it's currently 8 30 right now and I have to leave in 30 minutes <laughs> And I still haven't finished packing this like always happens and I swear it's just Oh my goodness. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know what to bring This is so bad. Um, okay. Well, I need to figure out what outfits I'm gonna bring, but so far I have two sleep shirts, all my like socks, underwears, whatever, underwears. <laughs> um, and then I'm bringing three pairs of jeans. Don't know what vibe of jeans I wanna bring. I'm bringing like 
four dresses a few like dressy type tops and then i need to bring some more chill tops and outfits for like running and grabbing coffee and just like chill stuff like that so i think on my way home i'm going to wear like a little like a tank top and like i don't know spandex type outfit that type of thing um but then on the way there today i'll wear like a tank top and like shorts or something um so like little chill outfits and i just need to figure out what shoes i want to bring <sighs> packing is my least favorite activity so i have my overflowing toiletries bag and then i have some makeup here makeup brushes some more like getting ready stuff like perfume um earrings hair clips and then this baby is my thing that i got yesterday in the mail that i talked about it's this little crimper for your hair love it so that's all of that stuff that I'm bringing. So here is my outfit for wearing there on the boat. Just a little crop tank top from Brittany Melville. My shorts are Shop Alley Grace. My bag is my Prada bag I always bring with me. Then these are just Converse that I got from Kith. They are like a cream color um, and they are a little bit platform. And now for what I am packing. It is so messy, but um, so the shoes that I brought are my my adidas sneakers adidas sneakers my heels all my toiletries and my makeup and stuff this bag right here is it feels like my prada one but it's from princess folly so love that and then over here is what i'm bringing in that bag i just have like what i i don't know like easy access stuff that i need and um a book for when i'm on the boat and stuff like that just to have in that bag and then i have a sweatshirt guys i'm literally going for not even like three days and i just oh my god i have an issue um i don't know if i'm bringing that sweatshirt yet because i have one in my bag that's gray and i don't think i need to bring a black one right or should i just bring the black one and not bring the gray or maybe I can just bring both. I don't know. Anyway, I have three pairs of jeans, like I said, because I don't know what jeans I want to wear when I'm there. I'm bringing these two basic t-shirts. Um, one's Brandy Melville. No, actually, they're both Aritzia. And then these two tank tops are both Brandy Melville. So basic tops. And then I'm bringing a bunch of cuter like tops for when we go out to eat and stuff. There's this little t-shirt one that ties I've never worn before. And then this Princess Polly one that ties. That's so cute. Another Princess Polly tank top that we can wear or I can wear to dinner or something. Another Princess Polly shirt that I'm obsessed with. That was in my most recent haul. This is from Verge Girl. It is a little shirt. I'm not sure if I'm even going to wear this one, but I brought it anyway. This little outfit would be so cute to wear to get coffee in the morning or something. It's like a little two-piece set just think it's so cute um and then these are all of the dresses that i brought with me so these three this floor one this other floral one and this green one are all princess polly and then these two are from revolve this one doesn't really fit me that well and this one didn't really look that good on me so that's why i brought these three because i just don't know which ones i am going to wear um and yeah and i can always wear like this during the day or something depending on whatever i want to do but that is what i am bringing i just have to put it whoa this lighting is not good now i just need to put it all into my suitcase but i need to figure out if i want to bring this sweatshirt or if i just bring my gray one because all the outfits that i'm bringing well it's not like i'm gonna wear it with the dresses but for the outfits for like the way home, which I'll probably just wear a pair of, um, I can't even look at the camera right now, but I'll probably just wear like a pair of like little shorts with a tank top. And it doesn't really matter which sweatshirt I wear, but I feel like the gray would look 
I mean, it's fine. Yeah, I'll just bring the gray. I'm not gonna bring this one. Okay, I'm all packed. I just need to grab a new battery for my camera, my AirPods to put in here, my wallet, masks, and then we are off to Nantucket. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a little short and sweet. Um, just a few days of my life, packing, stuff like that. So if you guys wanna see the Nantucket vlog, this one will be up before that and just keep on the lookout for that video. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy and I hope you guys like it. I feel like the whole Nantucket vlog will be so, 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 so fun. So make sure you are waiting to see that um and yeah i need to get going it's 8 58 literally right on the dot ready to go let's go it's gonna be so 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 fun i can't wait um i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys